subscribe, click the bell, and turn on all notifications. The one-stop destination for all WWE and AEW. Sean's View Entertainment. Ladies and gentlemen, I might have done a video in the morning and it made me afternoon right now, but I told you that I would do multiple videos a day and that's what I've been doing for the last several years and that's what I will continue to do right here on this very channel, this very station. Remember to click the bell, subscribe, and always turn on all notifications because this is your ultimate destination for all WWE. Why? Because this is your choice and I wouldn't have it any other way. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a lot of rumors, a lot of news, a lot of headlines to discuss, and we have a lot to get into, and not a hell of a lot of time to do it, because I'm working on a lot more stories for today, a lot more videos, and guys, this is why you, you can't always rely on YouTube. I, I, I cannot tell you how much I got to urge you and let you know, and please check out my channel. I, do I have to beg and get on my hands and knees? Go up and down my channel every day. Visit my page, YouTube. Dot com, Sean's View Entertainment, right here. And we're going to be on a damn tear. All right. We got some big news on CM Punk. We got some breaking news on Roman Reigns. We got huge news on Sami Zayn. And we're going to explore all that and more on Sean's View. CM Punk, now we got a massive clarification. Now we heard that CM Punk wants to sign and be with the WWE forever. Well, monumental update on that monumental update in response to the rumor cm punk posted an ice tea co a quote on his instagram story seemingly slamming the speculation of his contract status and a new report by pw insider cm punk is currently on a contract with wwe until november of 2026 excluding any injury related extensions which we all know cm punk has been out on injury now Despite the existing agreement, WWE and CM Punk are in talks for a new contract. WWE initiated these discussions aiming to secure an even more substantial deal. The motivation behind this move, despite an already established contract, stems from the advantage landscape, the evolving landscape of the WWE, the business as a whole, in view, uh, involving huge numbers, merchandise, socials, as mentioned in your discussions. We were told that the WWE are the ones that approached Punk about working out a new deal. Multiple WWE sources confirm they are seeking to lock in Punk as described with a bigger deal. Two sources used that terminology, that what was described as a bigger deal, and stated that it was something that the company initiated, not Punk. And it appears CM Punk will remain with WWE for the foreseeable future as he seems satisfied and is creatively engaged. To the best in the world is set to return to in-ring action at SummerSlam on August the 3rd against Drew McIntyre with Seth frickin' Rollins as a special guest referee. The WWE is said to be happy with how CM Punk has been backstage, his attitude, his professionalism, his merchandise deals. Even though CM Punk isn't wrestling, even though CM Punk isn't competing, even though CM Punk is out on injury, he is one of the hottest top merchandise sellers today. And you cannot argue that. You cannot argue numbers. And when CM Punk appears on television, the ratings go up. Now, I'm not saying they're skyrocketing or they're going to Attitude Era ratings, but the ratings do go up when CM Punk is on the show. Make no mistake about that at the end of the day. Also, Sami Zayn reveals how stand-up comedy career began. Yeah, we didn't know that about Sami Zayn. We didn't know he was a funny guy. We didn't know he was entertaining in that aspect. But I guess, you know... It is what it is. Hulk Hogan cuts promo during a Detroit Lions NFL training camp. Yes, the immortal one, Hulk Hogan, is getting involved all over the place, whether that be in politics, whether that be in football, or whether that be in where it all started, professional wrestling for the Hulkster. Also, Shawn Michaels calls out Pat McAfee's co-host after negative remarks about NXT stars. The heartbreak kid Shawn Michaels is none too happy about that. Booker T believes that casual fans have lost interest in hour-long TV wrestling matches. And we just saw one the other night on, M on, on AEW. What do you think about going Broadway, going in an hour, going in Iron Man style? Are you a fan of hour-long matches? Chris Jericho brags about AEW being profitable after Dynamite crosses over 250 episodes. Hey, they could have been at 350 episodes. The fact of the matter is they need to level up. They need to get gone of the ratings. They need to garner an audience, an actual audience to fill up the arena. Hey, maybe they should do what TNA is doing. Instead of going to arenas and, you know, more, more money being spent, more rent space, why not try the bingo halls? Why not try the gymnasiums? You know, why not try, oh, well, Sean, they filled up the UK. Obviously, they have a bigger audience in the UK. 
Or maybe they should go to the UK more often. Hey, if they can fill up a whole stadium, maybe the AEW should go to the UK a hell of a lot more. Listen, there's nothing wrong with, you know, having a smaller venue that you can actually, that looks good on television. Because when you're in an arena and it's not even half full, it's half empty, doesn't look too good. Anyhow, CM Punk seemingly reacts to rumors about his contract status. Also, Scorpio Sky addresses a prolonged absence from AEW television, and Swerve Strickland addresses Ricochet's potential AEW debut. And AEW drew an impressive number with the Blood and Guts attendance on 724. See? They drew an impressive number with their attendance. Good for them. I want to see that happen. I want to see them be competition to the WWE. I want to see them challenge the WWE. I want to I want to see AEW stress out the WWE so the WWE has to do even better. They have to get even more influential. They have to get even more creative. They have to get even more compelling. I want AEW to be competition. That is exactly what I want at the end of the day. But is that what we're getting? Quite frankly, at this stage of the game, no, that is not what we are getting. Also, viewers, fans, and subscribers, breaking backstage news being leaked on Roman Reigns. Now, what we're hearing, is Roman Reigns going to come back as the tribal chief? Is Roman Reigns going to come back as a completely different character? Or is Roman Reigns going to come back due to creative plans being leaked online? Again, rumors and speculation. Plans can change. Again, plans can always change. But according to those in the know, there is rumors and speculation about Roman Reigns returning as a... Well, you get a dual effect. You're going to get Roman Reigns' shield slash bloodline. Now, I don't know how they're going to work this out. I don't know how they're going to do this. There's going to obviously have to be a creative adjustment. But do you want to see Roman Reigns come back as a full-fledged shield? Looking like his shield days with the vest, the uniform, and all that? Or do you think he should be the tribal chief? The shirtless Roman Reigns. The man that is was a dominant champion for many, many a years. Speaking about Roman Reigns in WrestleMania 41, there is strong speculation that at WrestleMania 41, it will be Roman Reigns versus Solo Sokoa, where Roman Reigns may potentially pass the torch to Sokoa. Now, do you think it's too early? Do you think it's too soon? Do you think it's the right time to have Roman Reigns versus Solo Sokoa? It's all about your thoughts, your comments, and your opinions at the end of the day. Sean's View Entertainment, again, wouldn't have it any other way. Remember to click that play button, subscribe, and become a channel member today. Also... What version of Roman Reigns do you want to see come back? What version of Roman Reigns needs to come back? Also, viewers, fans, and subscribers, in other news that is breaking ground backstage in the world of WWE, whether it be Raw, whether it be SmackDown, or whether it be NXT, Sean's View Entertainment is your premier place to be. We do it premium, we do it on time, and we do it all the damn time. Make sure to hit that bell, subscribe. Sean's View Entertainment comes to you on your cell phone, your laptop, your desktop. It is free to watch. But if you want to help out the show and help secure my future and help me last on this very website, you got to become a channel member today to help out the brash and the brazen so you can make this absolutely brilliant. Subscribe.